in in this limit example um, again we'll try to plug in h equals zero notice if we do plug in h equals zero we'll get four squared which is sixteen minus sixteen so again we'll get zero on top and clearly we're getting zero on the bottom so we have to do something algebraic to try to figure out what's going on here notice um, the only thing that I see right off the bat at least is there's this four plus h squared so we could always cancel or excuse me expand that out and see if something cancels out so again remember this is four plus h times four plus h so we'll get sixteen plus four h plus four h that'll give us plus eight h plus h squared minus sixteen all over h well the sixteens will cancel out and I'm left with 8h plus h in the numerator but since they both have an h I can factor an h out of there then I have 8 plus h left over divided by h and again now I can cancel out my h's and this h in the bottom is what's you know certainly giving me some problems anyway because I'm dividing by zero so I'm left with the limit as h approaches zero of eight plus h and again we go back to our old trick of plugging and chugging if you plug in h equals zero we're left with eight and that is our solution